With time already served, Akon Guo could now walk free in a little more than 10 years for killing three of her children. Lawyers acting pro bono for the murdering mother successfully appealed her sentence of 26 and a half years that was handed to her just last May. The Court of Appeal accepted the 39-year-old had a disturbed state of mind when she deliberately drove her car into a lake in Windervale in 2015. Four of her children were on board when the vehicle plunged into the water and despite the desperate efforts of bystanders and emergency services, only one child survived. 16-month-old baby Bol and four-year-old twins Madit and Anga couldn't be saved. Akon Guo told police she had a dizzy spell, only later pleading guilty to two counts of murder, one of attempted murder and a charge of infanticide, an offence committed when a mother has a disturbed state of mind within two years of giving birth to the child they've killed. The Court of Appeal accepted this compromised mental state should have applied to the sentence Guo received for all charges. The judges expressed pity for the killer's situation, that despite the expectation she would protect her children, it must be remembered that her capacity to make calm and rational decisions was severely compromised by her mental condition. On appeal, Akon Guo was sentenced to a new maximum term of 18 years jail to serve a minimum of just 14 years.